Take a look at this channel, it's actually one of my side channels. I don't post on it consistently, but the views still perform really well. Now, you might ask, what's the niche that gets this kind of interaction on shorts? The truth is, it's not just about the niche. I use a secret strategy that keeps viewers watching till the end. And the more people watch your videos all the way through, the more the YouTube algorithm pushes them to a wider audience. But wait, if you are finding it hard to keep up with creating content for all your social media platforms, Growing and diversifying can be a challenge, especially when time is limited. But what if you could make it easier? By repurposing your long-form content, you only need to record once and then share it across multiple platforms to boost your growth. That's why you should try Nexus Clips. This tool is a favorite among creators of long-form videos and live streams. Thanks to this platform, you can easily create multiple short videos from a single long-form video. For example, let me show you how it works. I have a long video here that I want to turn into short clips. First, click on this option and select your video. The tool uses AI to suggest moments, providing a simple rating for each one. As you can see, this moment in the video has an 85 rating. You can either choose the suggested moments or create your own clip by clicking the Create Clip button on the right. Before you start, make sure to connect your YouTube or Twitch account. Once that's set up, Select the part of the video you want, then click Edit Clip. Wait a few seconds, and boom. Now you can customize how your video looks. For example, I'll add my AI avatar at the top and place the screen at the bottom. You can also add stickers, hooks, and subtitles with various templates. After finalizing your edits, download the video by clicking the Share button. This tool works for any niche, so give it a try. Nexus Clip link in the description. If you scroll back to my older videos, you'll notice some barely hit 700 views. But once I started analyzing my channel and figured out the best time to post, the difference was huge. Videos started hitting 10K, 20K views, and more. And remember, I don't even focus on this channel. I know you're probably thinking, okay, enough talking, what's the secret? Don't worry, I'm going to show you the full strategy, step by step, from writing the script to publishing the video. But before we jump in, if you have any questions, feel free to reach out in my Telegram community. Just make sure to send your message privately. I'm the admin there under the name Slimu. See you inside. Now the first thing I do is simple. I go to YouTube and just scroll through YouTube shorts until boom, a video gets my attention. I say to myself, hmm, this video will work, let's try it. I start writing my idea. For example, this video, as you see, is about a dog chasing the delivery man when he tries to put the order behind the house. As you see, now I will open my notepad and start writing the script. I separate the script into two paragraphs. The first one is for the intro. For example, here we can write, here are the top funniest moments when the dog is trying to chase the delivery man. But before that, make sure to subscribe to watch tomorrow's video. After this, we go to the second paragraph, where we describe what we will see in the video or try to explain the situation. For example, we can say, when the delivery man tries to put the order, the dog starts chasing him and running after him, and the delivery man starts running to get out of the house, etc. You can add your explanation based on what you see exactly, using simple language so everyone can easily understand what is happening in the video. After writing the script, we copy it part by part and go to ChatGPT to ask it to correct or rewrite it in a better way. We do the same process for the second paragraph. After that, we copy each paragraph and go to 11 labs. Here I use the Alex voice as you see, but you can use any voice and choose one that is not famous to be unique. That's your choice. Then, we follow the same process as usual. We paste the script, click the generate button, and download the audio. We do this for both paragraphs. After that, now we go to YouTube and search for free stock videos that we can use without worrying about copyright issues. Also guys, after all that, we go to Pixabay and search for music that we can use in our video. We will use two tracks, one for the intro and one for the whole video.
After that, we open our CapCut application, as you see. Then, we add all the files we downloaded earlier, as you see. Next, we start by adding the vocal for the intro, like you see. After that, we add one or two clips to grab attention in the intro. We cut them to sync well with the voice of the intro. Then, we add the second voice. And don't forget to remove the spaces between the speech in the voice to have smooth storytelling. After that, we add the video that we want to explain. As you see, first we remove the audio from the video like here. Then we try to display the video according to the script. For example, if the audio says, the dog starts running, we can duplicate the clip of the dog running by copying and pasting it. In the second clip, after the replay, we can add some arrows to the dog to better explain what's happening in the video. We continue using the same method until the whole video is done. After all that and when the video is ready, we can add some effects. For example, I usually add one effect, the vignette, and lower its opacity to 40%. You can also add stickers, sound effects if needed, or some transitions. That depends on you. Now for the last steps before adding the background music, I start by going to the text option. Then, I select the English language and click on Create Auto Captions. We wait until they appear. After that, we select them all, and then we choose a simple animation for the captions. After that, you can change the templates, fonts, etc. But for me, I will choose this font. We also change the color and add a simple black glow so the captions appear well. Now we can add the background music. The first one for the intro, and the second one for the second part of the video, like you see. Then, now you can export your video. But wait, you will need a title and a description. What I do on my second channel is simple. I go back to ChatGPT, where I asked it to rewrite the script before, and then I ask it to write me the best title to go viral on YouTube Shorts in a description. It writes exactly what we need. Then we copy it and go to YouTube to make the video public. And that's all, guys. We'll meet in another video. Love you all. Bye-bye.